Good morning and thank you for joining us. Let's start today's technical analysis with the euro dollar pair and the recent events during the markets. Greg? The euro dollar pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, gaining 0.1%. The ROC is giving a negative signal. The last session saw the Aussie fall 0.4% against the dollar. The stochastic RSI is giving a negative signal. The pound-dollar pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, rising 0.2%. The stochastic indicator's positive signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. The last session saw the Bitcoin gain 0.5% against the dollar. The stochastic indicator is giving a negative signal. Thank you for sharing with us. Now let's hear from our news department. Shares slipped in Asia after last week's decline on Wall Street, while signs of a surge in coronavirus infections in China suggested progress may be bumpy as it rolls back its zero-COVID pandemic restrictions. Maple Finance, the largest unsecured crypto lending platform, is grappling with a debt crisis while gearing up for a major system upgrade. The project's MPL token has plunged and depositors are likely to stomach big losses. Malaysia's state energy firm Petronas said it would work with JX Nippon Oil and Gas Exploration Corp on a joint proposal to monetize gas potential in the Bujang, Inas, Guling, Sepat and Tujo fields located off the shores of Peninsular Malaysia. Thank you for this. Coming up, today's major economic events. Japan's machinery orders will be released at 2350 GMT. The UK's claimant count change at 0700 GMT the U.S. Consumer Price Index at 1330 GMT. Germany's ZEW survey, current situation, will be released at 1000 hours GMT. The UK's ILO unemployment rate at 0700 hours GMT. The U.S. Consumer Price Index core at 1330 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join our next review for the latest news and events from the financial markets.